Well, four years ago, Facebook founder Mark Zuckerberg donated $100 million to improve the school's Newark. The money's been spent, and critics say that there's nothing to show for it, in fact. Fox News' Lisa Evers looked into this and spoke to Newark's new mayor about what's next for the schools there. She's in the newsroom with more. Lisa, what did you find? Well, Darian and Ernie, it's a problem that stumps some of the best minds in the country, improving education for the children of Newark. Now, with the election of a new mayor, one thing is crystal clear. There is already a shift in focus. We are um, canvassing for children to expand our preschool program. We don't want our ch children to go to charter school. We want to keep them right here in the public school. As a former high school principal, Mayor Lech Raz Baraka knows the challenges facing children from the inside out. Voter outcry over a wave of education reforms helped him win election. Many residents oppose the Newark One plan to close public schools and send children outside their neighborhoods. With Newark's entrenched gang violence, that can mean life or death for kids. While former Mayor Cory Booker looked to big money donors across the country for help, Baraka believes Newark already has what it needs to succeed. The college community, the universities that are here in our town, the, the, the parent community, uh, the teachers, uh, the activists, and begin to organize a strategy that talks about how we move the city forward academically, uh, a plan that includes both traditional public schools and charter schools. He told me he doubts any of that $100 million Facebook donation made on national television to former Mayor Cory Booker and Governor Chris Christie ever made its way to the children. But he quickly adds that wasn't its intent. Reports show at least $50 million was used to settle teacher contracts and pay incentives. And it was split between the city and the state. Political analyst Steve Adubato explains it like this. It's an incomplete as to whether that money really made a difference. But I'll tell you what, you can forget about that corporate money. You can forget about that big foundation money. Facebook is saying bye-bye because I don't see them playing the same game with Roz Baraka being mayor. The state has had control of Newark Public Schools for years. The city's had some of the most successful charter schools in the country, and its public schools have produced national success stories. But overall performance for most children has been below par. Baraka says there are positive lessons from charter schools, but that's not his main focus. Uh, my job as the mayor of the city is to make sure that public institutions are strong, and traditional public schools are public institutions, so I need to make sure that they work, that they function, that they stay open. Political analyst Steve Adubato predicts there may be fireworks between Governor Christie, who still has control of Newark schools, and the new mayor, who is vowing to prove the city can do it on its own.